Hey, what's going on folks? Chris here with the newly released 4K edition of Escape from LA from 1996 starring Kurt Russell. The sequel to the awesome film Escape from New York directed by John Carpenter, which uh, reunites the legends for the fifth time. The other films they made together were of course Elvis, The Thing, and Big Trouble in Little China. So it took about 15 years for this sequel to come to fruition. And although it's not a great film, it's still pretty cool to see Kurt return as Snake Plissken. Although I gotta say, some of the CGI effects are pretty laughable, but it's a sign of the times. Then again, T2 was released 5 years earlier, and effects on that look spectacular. But who knows, it could also be because of budget constraints. Either way, it's tons of fun, and it features a solid cast with Steve Buscemi and the lovely Italian actress Valeria Golino. Also features Pam Greer, the late great Peter Fonda, and Bruce Campbell in a pretty odd role. So anyway, regarding the presentation, this was shot on 35mm film. And uh, for a movie that mainly takes place at night, I was a bit worried about black crush issues, but thankfully that wasn't the case here. It looks pretty darn great with uh, deep inky black lows and it's uh, practically sharp throughout the whole film with very minimal softness in a few scenes here and there. And nice grain structure, very film-like and not overpowering. I'm very pleased with this transfer. And the uh, same can be said for the audio. Although it's the 5.1 mix, not an Atmos. But the dialogue, the music, the various sound effects all sound excellent and well-balanced throughout. It's actually a very engaging mix for a 5.1 with uh, plenty of bass during the action. So overall, I'm rating the picture quality a 4.5 out of a 5 and a 5 for the sound. For features, unfortunately, there aren't any, only the trailer, which is disappointing. But there's a cool Shaw Factory edition on Blu-ray if you want some extras. So uh, yeah, man, nice to see this 90s action flick in 4K. Still holds up pretty well as uh, Kurt Russell kicks some ass. And until next time, take care.